So, one of my viewers in Germany posted a comment about lighting thermite, asking if I can light thermite with a match. And I gave him the honest answer, I don't know. Uh, I just always assumed, since people normally use magnesium or sparklers or some such, that matches wouldn't light thermite. But I suggested he give it a try, and he said that being in Germany he can't, so here's my attempt at it. Let's see if we can ignite thermite with a match. So we've got our thermite here, same thermite we've been using. I'm going to just put a little bit in the center here, spread it out just a little bit. And that's not very much thermite, although still dangerous. Don't try this at home if you don't know what you're doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm turning home, so who am I to say anything? Anyways, let's get this go with a match. Step one, light the match. Step two, get the match to stay lit. A little windier today than I'd like and the match goes out. Try making a little protected area area in there for the match to sit in. I might leave that there just to help it along some. Hmm. Buy cheap matches, get cheap matches. Who the thunk? Wow, those go out almost immediately when I set them down. Okay, so my second part of this plan let's cut off some match heads, put those in there and see if that'll light it. I'll fast forward through this part so you don't have to watch the tediousness of me cutting off each mesh head. Okay, I got about 15 match heads in there. I didn't count, don't hold me to that. See if we can light it and if that will light off the thermite. I've got a suspicion the answer is no, but I think this gives us our best chance. And I might be wrong. Look at that. I can't even light a match with another match. It's an interesting match head. Let's see what that gives us. A quick flame out. Match heads are lighting. There's still some flame in there. It doesn't appear to get hot enough fast enough to light off the uh, thermite. Okay, let me um, chop up a bunch more match heads. We'll get a bigger, better pile going here. And we'll see how that goes. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, we cut off a bunch more match heads. Uh, the very scientific, more than 50. Probably 64, assuming the box is correct, with 32 in each. We did two boxes. Cut off the heads here. We're going to put those in the center of the thermite in that little divot we created. 
We have this cardboard box as a windbreak. Yep, I know. Cardboard, fire, doesn't mix well. It's been pointed out to me. It's okay. I, I trust that it won't light much. So, let's give it a try. I think that's the biggest flare up we're gonna get. And I think that it shows fairly conclusively that at least the matches that I'm using won't light thermite. I do have a fancy lighter I'm gonna try. I'll have to create a little tail into it since I don't want a big pile of thermite to light off in my hand. I'll just try to do the edge and hopefully it will crawl up to the big pile and I can jerk my hand out of the way before I end up with a uh, hand burned by thermite. We know what that looks like. Okay, so here's my son's lighter. It's pretty cool. It's got a little... You can't really see it in this light, but it, it's electric. And it makes a little electric spark across there. It might light the thermite. You know, before I do it on the thermite, let's see if it'll light a match. Lights a match pretty good, so we got that going for us. Let's see how it does with the thermite. And hopefully my reflexes are enough, so... Yeah, you got 911 to speed that, right? Totes. Well, it sparked the thermite. My reflexes were good enough. Let's get a little bit more in there. Hey, look at that! So you can light thermite with a lighter. Do I recommend it? No. All that smoke and stuff you see is leftover uh, matchstick and matchstick heads. But that was pretty cool. And by cool, I mean that is really, really hot. Do I recommend lighting thermite with a lighter? No, I don't. Use a sparkler like most sparkler. Jeez, learn to speak like most normal people do, because normal people play with thermite all the time. But use a sparkler, keep a safe distance. If you're gonna play with thermite, again, don't recommend it. And be safe out there. Thank you for watching.